Nika, is the name of a mythical warrior that was once revered as the sun god by slaves from the ancient times. He was first mentioned by Who's Who, who heard about the legend from a prison guard during his imprisonment by the world government. According to Dr. Vegapunk, Nika's existence is only recorded in the most ancient of texts, having been otherwise erased in more modern documents. There exists a mythical zoan-type devil fruit, called the Hito Hito no Mi model, Nika, that allows the consumer to gain Nika's traits and abilities. For unknown reasons, the world government is extremely interested in this fruit, and has even covered up its identity by renaming it to the Gomu Gomu no Mi, preventing other parties from garnering special interest to the fruit, and seeking it out themselves, such that not even members of the four emperors, and their respective crew seem to be aware. Currently, the fruit's power is in the possession of Monkey D. Luffy, based on his single, silhouetted appearance. Nika seemed to be a lanky, warrior-like figure with noodly limbs and flame-shaped hair. He apparently wore something on his thighs, but nothing else. According to Dr. Vegapunk, Luffy's awakened form looks like Nika as he was described in ancient texts. Personality, according to the legend heard by Who's Who, Nika was a heroic, benevolent figure who was a friend to slaves. It was said that Nika would one day come for the slaves to liberate them from their oppressive masters and bring smiles to their faces, powers and abilities. The legend states that Nika was a great warrior. In his silhouette appearance, he was seen holding a sword and a spear. Nika's signature trait was his body having the composition of rubber, which allowed him to fight in just about any manner he could think of. The variety of ways one could fight with this ability can be seen. With Monkey D. Luffy and his usage of the fruit modeled after Nika, history, legend. Nika has been worshipped since ancient times by slaves who believed that he would eventually come to free them from their suffering. It is, however, unknown if such a figure actually existed or not. Although Dr. Vegapunk has confirmed the existence of ancient records that mention him, who's who? A former member of CP9 who was once imprisoned for his failure to safeguard the Hito Hito no Mi model, Nika heard about the legend from an unnamed prison guard and then started giving his prayers for Nika with the intent of easing his own suffering. When Who's Who noticed that the same prison guard who told him about the legend suddenly vanished from duty, he suspected that the story was not meant to be shared and that the world government had done something to the guard. He then decided to break out of prison in order to escape a potentially worse punishment for knowing too much. Who's Who mentioned Nika to Jin during their fight, as the former associated the fishman race with slavery and asked Jinbei about the legend. Angered with the assumption of the relationship between fishmen and slavery, Jinbei chose not to respond and instead delivered a critical blow upon Who's Who. Devil Fruit. Although it is unknown whether a true Nika has ever existed, there exists a mythical Zoan-type devil fruit called the Hito Hito no Mi model, Nika that allows the consumer to gain Nika's abilities. Ever since then, the world government had been extremely interested in this fruit for centuries, and for unknown reasons. This interest is of a nature that has led them to erase the fruit's existence and original name from all historical recordings, renaming it to the Gomu Gomu no Mi and reclassifying it as a paramecia. Despite the government's efforts to seek after it, the fruit managed to elude them, to the point where one of the five elders in the present day questioned if the fruit itself was nothing more than a legend as well. The government finally acquired this fruit around 12 years before the present day, but it was stolen from one of their ships by the Red Hair Pirates. Ironically, it was Who's Who that was stationed on the ship and it was his failure to prevent the fruit's theft that led to him being imprisoned and learning about Nika. The fruit was later eaten by a seven-year-old boy named Monkey D. Luffy who found it lying around with the Red Hair Pirates and mistook it for dessert. And he has possessed this power ever since. While the Red Hair Pirates were aghast when they discovered Luffy had eaten the fruit, it remains unclear if they were aware of the fruit's true nature. After another defeat against Kadao, Luffy managed to awaken the fruit's powers. The first time after centuries, when Luffy realized his new powers, he leaped through the sky in a pose identical to Who's Who's description of Nika. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like the video and don't forget to subscribe.